they just keep going and going and going. All right, everybody, welcome back to Decidedly Vanilla. I'm over here in Freehaven, just grabbed a few things. I needed some blaze rods to make ender chests. I didn't have any blaze rods over at the tower. It's... which way is it? It's that way. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I totally got distracted by the whale thingy. It's so cool, the two carts, like, sync up once in a while. Uh, it's very fun just sitting there watching that. It reminds me of the uh, bouncing egg that was over there, if you guys remember that. I may do another one of those. I may do a chicken bomb, too. I love trying my chicken bombs. Just get a ton of chickens in a small area and light some TNT. Blow them up. Let's hop through the nether. I have nice easy access to the tower and to the quad spider farm now. Uh, I need to uh, figure out if there's going to be a tunnel made this way or if I need to make my own tunnel. Guess I will ask Core. He made the uh, nether hub. Very cool. Down here is a little room with a nether portal to the quad cave spider spawner. So it's very easy access from the Freehaven portal. And then we can hop into the portal to my tunnel. And we come out kind of in a construction site. Get away from that noisy portal. Loud cave noise. Uh, but yeah, I've started working on the dock area and portal room building. I'm not sure what's going to be. Uh, I'm thinking like a harbor building, like a, a port. We'll have some boat docks here extending out. This is at sea level. <laughs> uh, so the docks will extend into the water that way. We'll have pillars going down to the ground. Uh, I'm not sure if this block will remain here, these blocks just kind of to get a footprint of the building and I think it'll look good need to figure out what materials I'm using and uh, I haven't really uh, come up with a plan but if we kind of work this block in those go very nice together I may use some dark oak wood not the logs uh, oop, hello. My brand new axe. Efficiency 5, Unbreaking 3, Fortune 3, Jefferson's Diamond Axe. Got that from my spider spawner. Did a little bit of grinding. Yeah, I think those blocks will need some glass. I want to have a lot of glass. Mm, not really sure. I haven't gotten to that point yet. But I'll probably just uh, fill in this floor, oak floor and get the walls in place start working on the ceiling and the windows I want to have large windows so you can see the tower when you come through the portal BAM tower and when you arrive via boat because this is water access to the sheep farm uh, so yeah I think I'm going to get my building on here I was able to finish off the roadway for now uh, as the place expands, we'll uh, keep working on this area. But for now, I want to focus on this building. All right, well, I'm going to get to building here, and we'll be back. All right, we are back. I have been doing some building. We can check it out from this view, which is very important to me. I'm going to be spending a lot of time up here. I want to be able to have a nice view from up here, and I like it a lot. Let's go down and check it out from down here. Uh, it took me a while, lots of different designs came in and out, uh, but here it is. Take a quick run through, out to the water. Still need to remove that floating birch tree. I can't believe that's still there. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we would arrive via boat here, and it's easy to get out of the water with the half slab, pop right out. Lots of the sea lanterns worked in. 
It's a good amount of stone brick. And I was thinking maybe getting some a stone brick border of stairs right there. But there's a few transitions throughout the floor. A lot of oak wood. Uh, I need to break up the oak wood somehow. So yeah, we can try the stone sla or uh, stone steps in there. This would be kind of the entrance way from the city. These are the only blocks I use. The rest are panes. Uh, the entrance way, I think it just looked better with the blocks. Don't need the uh, any border there or a door. I'm going to leave it nice and open like that. And little corner accents. This roof, uh, it, it's kind of a hack job up top. I just filled it all in with uh, bottom slabs. I don't know what you want to call them. Upside down slabs. So there's no spawning area on top. But uh, it's kind of hollow in the center a little bit. But I like how this corner came out. I think it looks great. Coming in from here, we'll probably get a tree here tree there once I clean up my work site and I need to get some more obsidian to put the portal right there so that where is where you will arrive from the nether right here and nice window looking out into the tower I think it came out great need to get some armor from the skelly spawner next time I'm over there I'll grab some armor for those guys very cool, kind of on their own little pedestals. Uh, so yeah, I'm happy with this build. Need to move the nether portal in and just do some details around. Work on the lighting a little more. Just need to work in a few more of the sea lanterns and get rid of the torches. Let's see. Let's see, those are stairs there. So if we go that get rid of these stairs just try to break up this oak floor a little bit get down there uh, let's see do I have any stone brick stairs 19 yeah that'll do all right so if we just come off this pillar like that uh, oh completely missed <laughs> uh, yeah, I like it. I like it. We'll keep going with that. All right, get on the pillar. Nice. So yeah, that breaks it up a little bit. I'll work in a little more. Maybe, hmm, maybe this slab. I don't know. I like the uh, oak transition right there. Hmm, maybe get some sea lanterns in somewhere, but I will figure it out and... These chests have lots of boats. If you need one, go ahead and use them. If you can, whoa, I put all these boats right here. And that one worked its way all the way out there. <laughs> Crazy. Let's come into the port. And can we eject onto the dock? Nope. Oh, glitching. Oh, we're under the dock. Come on. Get out. Yes. Haha. <laughs> Maybe put a ledge underneath so you can't go underneath of it like that or very easily uh, we'll see how much use it will get more for uh, looks and yeah I like it I like it a lot <laughs> uh, so yeah I'll get some more obsidian and some armor and I still don't have a banner design I need to come up with a banner design something incorporating the tower design I don't know I'll hop on a website and try to figure something out and get my banner up but yeah I like that it fills in that corner nicely decent amount of space between the tower could run a path through here connect it to this if we wanted I still need to figure out what I'm doing with this uh, coast uh, we'll see Maybe I will follow the same, what did I do over here? Just, yeah, just stone brick posts or pillars with the sea lantern on top. Uh, but this is going to be my attempt at the timer for the quad spider spawner XP farm. We'll see if that's the right time. 
Not sure. I can remove... <laughs> they break so easily. I can remove a row or add another row if it's not long enough or if it's uh, the length of this redstone uh, determines the time of the current. Uh, I don't know redstone lingo enough to explain how it works, but the farther away from this it, uh, the quicker it will uh, unpower. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's head through the nether. I don't even need to cut now to uh, go to the quad cave spider spawner. We can just hop into the nether. And do to do, do figure. Come on. Come on, game. Let's go. And drop down this hole before the gas shoots us. Come on. Get down. Get down on it. I need to turn my hostile mobs. Uh, music and sound. Hostile creatures to three. Let's go that to 65. Uh. Well, I need to go back. I need to pick up all of the uh, comparators and things like that, because those are the only ones I have crafted. All right, we made it, and I have everything I need, hopefully. Uh, so there's the three pistons in there. We need to get in there. Uh, can I get in here? Yes, okay, that was perfect. Uh, cobble up, and let's see, those are the pistons, that's the switch. Hmm, I think I can make this work. Everything is above me. Should be enough room here. I know there's, like, a, a lot of the, uh... abandoned mine shaft in the area, and we're at lava level. So there's going to be uh, some lava. Ooh, there's some water there. All right, so I will dig this out and try to set this up. See if I can get these pistons to have kind of like a 10-second kill. It's pretty much what I need. I can't dig up too high. Uh, so yeah, let me figure this out. We'll be back. All right, I think I have it all set up now. I am up to level 37 just from doing the work around here, killing them off as I am testing it out. Uh, we can check it out as they keep flowing in. Back here, are they going to hit me? Ooh, they keep hitting me as I go through there. I have the line of comparators set up. I put a redstone repeater right here just to strengthen the current. Uh, because like I was trying to say, the strength of the current going in is equal to the strength of the current going out. Uh, just because the way it works. Uh, so let's close that up. Easy access to it right there. And I put in a stopper. So yeah, step one, flip the lever, stop the flow of spiders. Step two, press the button. And wait. Shouldn't die. There we go. And step three. I've used a lot of potions. You can either punch them. Some of them die one hit. I think they're all two hits though with the fist. But I will have the Bane of Arthropod sword in there. Or you can just splash them with a harming potion. I'll have all of the ingredients right there to brew them up if you need to, or I will have some brewed up. Gather your XP. So much string. Let's grab the string. Can't even grab it all. 38. Yeah, tons of levels. Going to do some enchanting, maybe some repairing. Everything's doing pretty good. Uh, are we going to get a double chest of string? Almost. Very cool. Haha. <laughs> uh, I know Cherry P Gamer was excited about the string for fishing rods. Alright, so then you can release the flow and repeat, repeat the process. Very cool. I am happy to have this set up finally. I wasn't going to do it, but uh, 
I think this may be a very powerful XP farm. Uh, if anybody comes here, do not AFK for long. I keep saying that. Uh, if they're watching the videos and they know about this, they should know it's very powerful. I'm very excited to have this project complete. Crazy quad cave spider spawner. You don't see that every day. <laughs> Alright, well I have set the portal up in the harbor building, let's say. Yeah, here we are. Very cool. It's, uh, what is it? 4x4? Four four? Nice fatty portal right there. I like it. Very cool. So yeah, we'll keep working on this building. And I am liking how this is coming together. Ah, uh, look at the beautiful sky. So cool. Alright everybody, that's going to do it for today. I want to let you know down in the description below there is a link to my Patreon page where you can set up to donate a small monthly fee to help support the channel here. Uh, but until next time, as always, thank you. I will see you later.